What's going on guys? A lot of you dudes kept hitting me across the head with this video all night and you know enough of you did it to the point where I'm going to watch it now. It apparently it involves Pac-Man in Smash Bros. Wii U. Something about him being broken. It seems like it's going to be a match replay. So what the fuck happens in this video that you dudes have to constantly tweet at me to watch this? You know there's certain times I get a gut feeling that I should do a video on something and usually when I get like you know 10 responses to something like when 10 people tell me to watch the same thing I usually don't really pay too much attention because you know a lot of people are always telling me to watch stuff but when 50 people tell me to watch something that's when you know their eyebrows raised and things start to change up so I don't know what the hell I'm about to do in terms of this video but watch it let's go I mean I'm confused I'm generally confused because I don't want to spoil myself I don't want to read the comments but I'm just generally confused as to how Pac-Man is broken as a video title could mean something so important that you guys wanted me to watch it. So let's just take a look at what's going on here. Shout outs to Things You Can Watch, the YouTube channel which made this video or maybe they just reposted it. Either way, let's see what happens. Okay, so it's a match replay. I don't know. Right now this video is buzzing online. I mean, at least from what you guys have been posting towards me. So it's a team of Pac-Man versus Captain Falcon and Link. What the fuck? Holy shit! <laughs> Holy shit! What the fuck? What the fuck is that? <laughs> Wait a minute, how? I never once thought of that. I guess the, the Captain Falcon Link team doesn't really know what to do. But what's the point? They're just gonna keep getting higher and higher and take more damage. What's the point of this? <gasps> Wait a minute, I know what's gonna happen. They're gonna make the match run out of time online. They're gonna make the match run out of time. And once it runs out of time, then it's gonna go to sudden death. They can use the trampolines to escape sudden death when the bombs come down. So when the bombs start falling, they're out of range. So the team that they're fighting will be left to die to the sudden death bombs. That means that Pac-Man, teams of two Pac-Man, are broken! Holy shit! How come no one ever realized this before? Sakurai! Daddy Sakurai, you gotta do something! You gotta do something, Daddy Sakurai! What's he gonna do? Something has to be done about this. And it's, it's pretty fucking hilarious because Sakurai himself recently in an interview said that he would not be doing any more patches to Smash Brothers that didn't really require his attention, that weren't really too necessary for him to do. And then we discover a game-breaking exploit online that needs attention. This has to be addressed right away. If this isn't handled, then this could break the game's online scene in terms of team battles because all you gotta do is just choose two Pac-Man. What if a team of two Pac-Man are going against each other? Then... <sighs> and here's the fucked up part. Even if the team gets pissed off and they want to leave, they can't because if they leave, it results in a loss for them. It results in a loss, so they can't leave. They have to deal with it. Holy shit, and then sudden death? The bombs, they're gonna escape. This, that is such a smart strategy! They managed to get away! Oh my... <laughs> Thank you for sharing with me this. I know I wasn't able to credit everybody because there were so many of you dudes now. I had like 70,500. There's so many of you dudes now, I couldn't credit you all. But this is game breaking! And the bombs, here come the bombs! Niggas is gonna die. You can't, you can't avoid it forever, man. Yeah, man, that is broken. People only realize this now? Holy shit! But I mean, it, then again, it hasn't really been that long since the game came out. It's only been three months. Has it been three? November. I mean, yeah, so it's been like less than three months in a sense. Because the game came out in November, December, January. It's not even, January hasn't even um, really gone through yet. So, yeah, it's been like, what, a month? Two, maybe a month and some change, but this is amazing. That is crazy. Wow, Pac-Man is broken. Daddy Sakurai has to do something about this right now. Well, you know what, Daddy? It looks like your work is cut out for you. You were talking about how you weren't really going to be doing any more patches, baby, but obviously whoever the hell thought of this and uploaded it had a different thing in mind. You're going to have to figure out something to do. But how does Masahiro Sakurai begin to patch something like this, which isn't even a bug, but simply just one bold-faced exploit that in interfering with could cause 
debalancing the game. Maybe he has to nerf Pac-Man's up air. His up B. Maybe he has to nerf. Maybe he has to nerf it. But if he nerfs Pac-Man's up B, then you know what will become the balance of the game. Something like that could change essentially a lot of stuff, or it could change nothing. It all depends. But something's got to be done. You can't leave the game in this state. You can't. That is fucking comedy gold right there. Or maybe Sakurai is just gonna say, you know what? Hey, fuck it. I don't care. Let these assholes do what they want to do. I ain't gonna have no part in it. But either way, what do you guys think is gonna happen? This is some eye-opening shit right here. I want to hear your opinions about this. But I'll talk to you in the next video. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one. And go check out the video in the description of the original so you can see more details about it. Kind of fucking crazy, man. But I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.